Hello guys, Temporal Cortex here with a little tutorial of how you can modify the UI overlays without even using, you know, any sort of photo editing software. Really, really easy. As long as the overlay has an elements pack, you will be able to do this. Um, so to start off with, I've just got an image here to show you the HUD, you know, on now I've scaled this HUD down so as you can see that it's not a default setting. So it's a bit smaller than it usually would be. And basically, first of all, what we're going to do, we're just going to right click on the sources box. I'm going to select image. So we'll call this champ because first of all, I'm going to add in the champ window, which will go in the bottom left. Um, and we're just going to go in here once I find it. Uh, so first of all, we've got the champ one. So we're going to open that up. And obviously, if I then click edit scene and drag this down, you can see that this is way too big. So what we want to do is we just want to scale it down and then we're going to click edit scene again. So that's it done for that bit. Then next we're just going to add in the center part like so. And we're going to pull that in. We're going to click edit scene again. We're going to bring it down. Generally I find it easier to bring it down on one specific part. And theoretically if we just keep on this down. You might have to do a wee bit of, you know, sort of maneuvering and tweaking. But you can get that down. Click edit scene again. Add image. Then we have the mini map. If I could spell. We'll add that in. So we'll click that. And we import in the mini map. Drag it down or edit scene. See I'm always doing it. So we're just gonna drag that down, make sure it snaps to the corner. Then just Shrink it down to sit. Um, so we are. Uh, then we click edit scene again. Add in another image. This is going to be the. I call it the info, but it's this information in the top right um, corner. And info timer, stuff like that. Okay. Edit scene. Drag it over, shrink it down, and click edit scene. And hey presto, you've sized the the overlay to suit your setup. So the reason that's why with the elements packs you should be able to adjust it to suit your HUD size and things like that. So uh, this was just a quick wee tutorial just to show you how you could do that. OBS obviously is a free software for streaming so I thought I'd do it in OBS just to show you um, and uh, yeah that's pretty much it guys I would ask that you sub and also keep an eye out on the channel because I'm going to have uh, something very interesting uh, coming out soon uh, for you guys and uh, I think you'll uh, enjoy it and somebody could get something very nice out of it but that's pretty much it guys be sure to sub and I will see you later bye now